So we got a nami up. I'm gonna do my best to make this. What a, is that? This is just a nami. See a much smaller needle, and we're gonna go very superficially inject uh, on top of the bubble. Oh my God. So, a little pinch right there, very yeah. gentle. And then here comes the injection. Now that's gonna burn. Build some pressure. Oh if you need to scream or cry, it's fine. Just just don't move your arm. And we're gonna get you nice and numb. Mm -hmm. Nice and numb, just slow, deep breaths, trying to trying to manage that pain, trying to think of something else as we we will one mm -hmm. cc, one cc injection. Mm -hmm. We could slow down a little bit. And uh, you can see the, the whiteness and the lidocaine infiltrating around there. So while the patient is getting the injection of the lidocaine, I want to take a minute to discuss what actually happened to this patient. No, this and is not an absolute infection CCs from drug abuse. Uh, this actual patient had a prescription uh, for an injection given to her worse and dispense the medication to give herself, well. but she wasn't really instructed on how to do it, now which is not her fault. She should have been instructed, she should have known, uh, it should have taught her how to do it. And instead of doing it a big muscle at the bottom or something like that, she tried to inject it in this area and resulted in this infection she actually had been to the emergency department once before they did an ultrasound that showed the collection of fluid versus an aneurysm it was an oh, yeah, the fluid so was she was put on antibiotics but obviously she was failing the antibiotics the infection is getting worse the bulge is growing and that's when she presented to the emergency department but it should be already feeling some some numbness yeah. A little. I'm gonna put a little more this way. Yeah. Oh, it's already trying to escape there. Oh, it's I haven't worse. even. It's so gross. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm sure that when we puncture, that's gonna just pour out, which is good. That's what we want. We got you covered up, so we won't get you all dirtiness. How you doing? A little more relaxed? How do you think the pain is? All right. Let's try to straighten out this arm this way a little bit. This is up through here. It's so tight. It hurts so mm -hmm. bad. All right. First, I'm going to touch it just to test it. Okay. What are you testing for? For make sure you don't scream at me or hit okay. me. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So we're ready to to give it a cut here. You can see starting to pour out. That's the infection. Lift up your arm for a second. We'll clean up your arm when we're done. We don't want all that stuff on you. This is disgusting. All right, you can put it back down for now. Let's put this underneath and back on it. We don't have to cut anymore. Next thing I want to do is take some of this lidocaine and kind of wash out the wound. Let me put some stuff in there. and let it come out.
so swollen. It is so swollen, but look how much better that is. Much, much better. And there's more in there. Not much more. No, it's all gone. <laughs> Now I'm going to use this iodine solution to kind of keep cleaning the inside of it. Yeah, build up a little pressure again and let it come out. Into the wound and back out. We do it a few times. Trying to get as much bacteria and junk as we can. So after the video ended, um, I did pack it with a little bit of gauze to make sure the wound stayed open and keep draining. Patient was instructed to Keep a close follow-up, send me some pictures as the days progress and make sure she's doing well. She already had some antibiotics, so I gave her uh, some pain medication. She was very grateful, very happy. She could kind of start moving her arm a little bit more. And uh, so hopefully we'll have some uh, pictures to follow up and see how she heals all together. Um, and I hope you enjoy and learn something from the video. And uh, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Looking for a great way to cut weight and look great? Well, it's time to check out Finergy. Available exclusively from Amazon, Finergy is America's top weight loss supplement. This elite fat burning formula turns your body into a calorie burning furnace, helping you target unwanted belly fat, love handles, and cellulite. Act now and start burning fat immediately. Coupled with diet and exercise, Finergy is the fastest, best way to meet your weight loss goals. I'm here to tell you about Restmore. It's an all natural sleep formula. And unlike Ambien or z that just knock you out, Restmore is non-narcotic and it helps you fall asleep with a unique blend of vitamins, herbs, and minerals. If healthy, restful sleep is important to you, I recommend Restmore. Restmore is an essential addition to your medicine cabinet for those times you need to fall asleep but can't. Remember, when you just need more rest, Get Rest More. Now available on Amazon. Good night.